Hello, welcome everyone on our video blog. My name is Bill Arkadiusz. Today I would like to say a few words about the Flug Multimeter 115. It was designed for Lincoln Tech. It's a standard uh, multimeter for electrician. So let's traditionally start um, from the measuring props, how they look like. So the probe have uh, nice sharp pins, they are galvanized, uh, the hand is um, covered by some uh, rubber layer, it's nice, the fingers stick it to it, uh, also the cable, it's quite high quality, it's rubber type of cable, not like the cheap one in Chinese. Uh, what else, the cable is attached to this hand, so it, it can't uh, take off when you measure it during from some time in the future. Uh, what else? Yeah. The the pin which we inside to the multimeter is zillow isolated. So the pin the these probes are excellent. It's flow quality, so it will no problem with that. How the multimeters look like? It's covered by the some yellow gummy layer from the outside. It's protect the multimeter when it falls down from from table, for example. It's basic uh, multimeter for electrician because um, it can't measure a milliampere and microampere current. It has only a ampere um, ampere option to measure. Uh, it has four buttons, the hold button standard, the minimax button. Uh, we, we can change also a uh, range from uh, manual to automatic and this yellow button allows to display this option which are uh, notice here their yellow option during this basic option here and also the backlight switch. The backlight is very good. It's a white backlight type. There's no problem with contrast and angle of this LCD. So we can we have uh, option of uh, alternative voltage, direct voltage, millivoltage, direct and alternative, uh, the resistance option, uh, the beeper option, uh, diode test option and the uh, current uh, alternative and direct. We can measure also using this when we press this button um, a frequency and the capacity of the capacitors. This look what the multimeter like back. Oh, it's quite heavy. It's small, but it's heavy. It's well done. On the other side, we have some power up option. I like what they 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 write this the instruction on the other side. It's very handy. So the power option is when we press button while turning meter on. When we press minimax button, we disable beeper. When we use this yellow button, when we press it, when we turn it on. We disable auto power off option and when we push the backlight button we disable auto backlight off. What else? Uh, let's see how the battery looks like. We should just uh, unscrew this one bolt here. So let's do that. The battery look like this. It's not an original battery. It's uh, I replaced it with one Chinese. And the nice thing is, you can't um, just um, push the battery in the wrong way here in the socket because it's a special array inside the socket, and why it's wider than the other, like the battery is. Yes? This pin is wider than this and you just k 
can't fit it in the wrong way here so it's avoid the battery to push it in the wrong way the battery fit is excellent it don't came off from here and the stand is also good quality nice plastic so take off this rubber cover here from the multimeter so you take it apart just unscrew these two screws here let's do it so what do we have here <coughs> the input connectors are the electric solder to the PCB this is a nice big fuse 10 amps fuse there's some plastic wall here and here I think it's the it protect the circuit here when the fuse just blow up and uh, there's a protection input protection like here and here uh, the battery uh, connector are directly soldered to the PCB it's a nice idea so there's uh, some uh, metal plate metal shield here a buzzer let's see what is under the shield uh, we must remember that this uh, multimeter are designed uh, are produced in China it's designed in USA but it's I think it's nice quality inside like the original one made in USA let's pop it out and we have a main chip it's made by Texas Instruments some oscillator uh, some capacity and I think it's good quality I think it's a medium standard um, multimeter for electrician so that's all goodbye